Well, happy Easter to you. I hope you had a wonderful holiday. For those of you that celebrate, you know, here at our house, we celebrated on Saturday for the most part, and uh, that was because uh, we had my son yesterday, and so we had the girls, and everybody together it was beautiful. Uh, and then today, I spent it actually in the yard and, uh, and working on stuff. So one of the things that you may have seen me working on in the video I posted about Gropple a couple days ago is I was starting up uh, on this drainage, and so I got drainage done. It's a nice four-inch PVC pipe so it can drain the water off, and it's going to get a test tomorrow. It looks like we've got about one to three inches of rain that's on the way. Uh, the reason such a big amount is generally one to two but if you get the thunderstorm that may boost the amounts of the big thing tomorrow is going to be the wind i actually got uh, got my chain saw sharpened while well, i sharpened it myself but nonetheless sharpened it up uh because i had to limb out some trees but the other part of it is i think some of us may need the chainsaw tomorrow in the yard so just something to keep in mind i mean you're talking 60 to 70 mile per hour wind gusts out of the south tomorrow very rare for us to get that kind of a southerly wind so some of the trees that don't usually come down on a nor'easter and northwesterly winds and all that may come down tomorrow uh, and that means it's probably going to be some power outages uh, that'll be cropping up so a number of you may lose power tomorrow particularly between 1 p.m and 8 p.m that seems to be the worst time and of course with everything going on the social distancing everything that's happening right now that may take a little while to get power on in some spots so be ready for that have your phone charged up uh, you know be ready to uh to keep the food cold and what have you may lose power for a little bit so uh chris kloniger has got a great rundown for you coming up on nbc and necn tonight uh, obviously on the station websites as well and i'll be in tomorrow morning well in from my living room tomorrow morning starting at 4 a.m I'll be looking for you uh, all morning long on NBC10, uh, including during the Today Show. So I hope you have a great night again. Happy Easter to those of you that celebrate, and uh, hope you enjoyed the day today. It was a beauty. Uh, just get ready for tomorrow. Take care.